Uh, okay, my friends, my dear friends, uh, just as I have suggested, I will do this on my new site, and I already did for Novi Turk, I did for Zakopani, I did for Dan Buck, Prushko, and so on. Uh, I got even accounts from few people uh, have confirmed me. Uh, even their life stories I got from people. Uh, not only about their professions and so on, but it recognized a bunch of psychologists and physicians and so on. Um, I am going to do the same thing for this place here now, for Sgirsch. Um, I am going to present, in other words, some audio recordings that are going to confirm definitely that uh, Sgirsch area, basically uh, suburb of Wuch, second biggest city, which is located right in the center of the Poland, did became some sort of second home of mine uh, when in U.S., from where I was brought repeatedly to the Eastern Europe, like I said, oftentimes, sometimes from 2002 and up, 2003 and up, right here to this area here, Grotnik in your watch. Uh, and, well, in this video I am going to present uh, a witnessing, a good description about the individual, about whom I actually know certain details more than he alone knows. And it's the stuff that I know about individual that uh, involves like health issues about him, I was told about directly from, uh, I was updated on the issue under MK Ultra directly from Polish psychologists. And I was also asked by these Polish psychologists who are watching this stuff not to mention this stuff that is related to his health. Because, especially I'm not going to do this because I see it's really efficient, but uh, you're going you're gonna to probably, a uh, little bit, you're going to get an idea about what this is, why I'm not going to do that. Um, but other than that, I got just, just too much stuff to talk about when it comes to Grotnikis Girsch that I would miss on. I can describe people, I can describe... Uh, it wasn't only people that uh, I can describe stuff like that um, as far as their life stories of, as far as their professions of, as far as stuff like this I actually got acquainted with even some intimate situations uh, not that 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 um, I would be the one that would uh, engage in those intimate situations, but the staff members did, uh, politicians did, and here and there they gave me some glimpse about what goes on, and that way I could actually even go and describe some private parts from females, and even I could update, uh, I could give even account about, of course I'm not going to do that publicly, I could even go as far as giving uh, reproduction status uh, on certain females uh, and that is already very very intimate and when I say something about who dated whom and this and that which I prefer I would not go into that uh, degree uh, you can better believe it and you know I'm just saying this because maybe authorities want to find out check with me if I really do know stuff like this which authorities already know that I do anyways. Uh, all right, anyway, anyhow, uh, in this audio recording, uh, what I'm going to do is an individual who helped me out to get this, um, give me a little green light, okay, uh, is a really nice individual whose name I'm not going to even mention. Um, I don't want to do that stuff, but I can give a little briefing. Uh, this individual met me, one of the first people who uh, was interested in this, through really um, unpleasant uh, situation which I have steered here in Poland. I, I, I was really not a happy tourist when he came to MKUltra. 
when I was brought here, my goal was to basically insult people as uh, severely as possible. And so I would do my best to get really personal with them, uh, get to know them personal, and then I would uh, give a strike. And uh, I have to say that it did, it did have, it did have a really good uh, impact uh, as far as the politicians. Uh, they, I did, I did reach the goal, but unfortunately, I also did hurt uh, some people that you know. For what I was told later on, that I am actually responsible, which I couldn't believe under MK Ultra that you're torturing, you would be responsible and stuff like that. That doesn't make sense, you know. I I felt that it's about the only time when you're tortured that you can actually go and insult people as much as you want, and uh, it it came out actually that it was really was a mistake. It was not a good deal. Uh, in this in this in this audio recording, individual whom I have recognized as a friend of who became my friend, uh, but. Before he became my friend, he was an enemy, of course, because he, I insulted him too. Uh, I brought, I I really caused kind of a division here in Poland with 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 the racist views and stuff like that. This is just a truth that I have to say, and as doing presenting this kind of views, a lot of people went like completely out of their mind. Okay, now again, I didn't hold myself responsible in any way, uh, and I like to make things up uh, for kind of uh, adding to split the community that time, uh, actually helping Benjamin Netanyahu to, do, to really steer problems here, because he had a whole, his crew here that would go and they would do graffitis and stuff like this all over the uh, Zgirsh watch area and would bully literally Polish people, challenge them, uh, start to make racism so he could do better deals, business, money, just like the case was with me. He somehow learned that, that there is a way to make money like this. And then what he would do is he would just expand this kind of operation and the uh, situation became really unfortunate. A lot of really good people suffered because of the stuff like this. I'm determined to pay my price and help uh, do the best I can. Uh, I don't know about others, but anyhow, uh, this individual was... Again, this is a friend of individual who met me and did not like me at all, did not like me at all. And uh, he would, you know, just like many other people, he would just somehow just maybe choke me a little bit. Uh, but then he was reprimanded for his behavior by the girl I am interested in. Um, she already got her license, uh, psychologist, she became psychologist then, and she a little bit, uh, very interested in me, strained up everybody, including these young people, uh, that were around me, because these young people around me that were, uh, boy, she defended me, I, I don't know what to say, I kind of owe her big time, uh, actually, when I think about it in the situation when I was, it was a whole a lot of young people that would just want to do like this with me, really, because of the stuff I did. But she just happened to be around, and she just calmed this whole thing somehow. Uh, now, the individual that you gonna actually that we're gonna talk about right now was individual who suffered big time emotionally. He was hurt. Uh, he already had a problem with back then. Sometimes in this, I say about 2006, it's not true. We met sometimes early in 2004. And the gentleman is, um, it's like this. He learns about me. He is all shocked. Uh, he already had problems, drinking problems back then. And now when he learns about this spook, 
uh, that is from Slovenia and is brought from the U.S. repeatedly for these negotiations purposes with Eastern European politicians, uh, kind of on behalf of West, uh, he completely goes out of his mind. Uh, now, he had a problems already with drinking, with the family, um, his last friend that never gives up on him is an individual I talk with, whose name again I will not give out. Uh, and even this individual, uh, his drinking problem become really, really bad. And at one occasion, this individual who got to know me and then he realized, people who got to know me realized somehow that I'm not such a bad boogeyman, uh, start to be very personal with me and people tell me a lot of things, discuss with me and so on. Uh, and he tells me that I almost give up on him because he became like totally, totally inappropriate. Like completely, completely inappropriate. Individual we are talking about eventually quits family. And you're talking about wife even, the whole thing. But there's only one person he would not quit. And that would be the person I am talking with right now. Uh, this gentleman is a young, promising individual, Polish guy that um, just loves to get involved socially. And uh, regardless of how bad it was, I actually admire him that for his age back then, he was like young, uh, really young. Uh, maybe, I don't know, maybe 22, I have no idea what his age was, that he was so mature that he would stick with him and put up with his whatever you want when this guy was totally, totally impossible. Now you're talking about a guy that would do nothing else but drink alcohol and according to his own words, uh, coffee and stuff like that. Um, Individual that would quit absolutely on everything, get on fight with 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 family, with his friends, give up on the whole thing. The only one again he would not give up on is in this is individual I'm gonna play the recording with. And I remember, yes, I do remember all this stuff. And in this audio recording, which is gonna be used as MK Ultra proof, I'm just gonna play an audio that uh, you know I say 2006 is not true. It goes all the way at least to 2004, 2005, and 2006, and so on, and over the years I was brought back. Eventually, individual we're talking about became completely okay. I was asked by psychologists who have entrusted me, who have updated me over the years about his situation, why also he became okay. Uh, and this is something I have promised them I would not even say. So when you say this, whether I was here and so on, I can go so deep about this stuff that uh, it's kind of spooky. But this is not, not my fault. I was updated about the stuff like this because psychologists, psychiatrists that were involved in this stuff, they alone became friendly with me. And they told me about things, about certain people, how their progress is in life. And on many occasions with the staff members and stuff like this, they shared even, well, just let's say somebody really deeply stoned under MK Ultra. Even I, you know, participated in some intimate situations, stuff like this, and got acquainted with some very personal details from people because they wanted to help me out. So the people that would give me this kind of details didn't give me this kind of details in a bad faith, but to actually help me out. So one day I could say, hey, you know. All right, let's go with this thing here first. This was the Cadence Girls Library. Yeah. But he looks good now. And that was what, the 
That looks very good now. Very good. She's married? I'm just gonna stop here. What other videos I can present about individual I spoke? Uh, a whole a lot of stuff. Audios, which I'm gonna go about. I have difficulties really with the battery, uh, with charging and stuff like this here. Okay, but eventually I'm gonna get this thing straightened up too. Yeah, so. It became very busy now outside of this room, as you see, what is interesting because it's almost 9 o'clock at night. So this probably is the best time to go and play soccer game or whatever. Um, anyhow, um, individual whose name I'm not going to say, kind of a gives me green light about the whole thing because he states that he would not even recognize the house where the girl I'm interested in was born, uh, where she lived. Um, that would be actually impossible because he really is like a scarce guy. He, he tells me like, in a way, I know this building, that building, that, but the one in between, I don't know. I don't remember if that building was over there, but this is just to tease me, just basically let me know that um, when I get across of that audio, it's just trying to tell me indirectly, you know, give me a green light basically about this thing, okay? So I'm using definitely this as, as one of the proofs. Again, if authorities want a challenge or anything like this, then I can give you the rest of the background on his, why he actually quit drinking alcohol, why he actually quit drinking what uh, I was told later on was a lot of coffee. And then I reminded myself why it was exactly, and so on. I can give this kind of details. I can go into it. I don't want to go into it because I wouldn't, I would more likely than not cause damage he probably is watching this thing i don't want to do that stuff so that's how all right today again today is march the 17 2019